Graciela for her Easter basket. I just finished putting it together today Yay. and I'm really excited to share this with you because I put a lot of uh, thought and planning into it and I think it came out uh, really really nice. Um, this last year she was only six weeks old uh, for Easter and I did make her a basket but she didn't really get to enjoy it because she didn't really know what was going on she didn't know what Easter was and this year she is a toddler uh. yeah <laughs> you're a toddler now huh and she can <laughs> interact with things um, she knows what she likes and she can have fun with toys and goodies and all of that so this is her basket now, I just used the basket that I had from last year. I got it at Target, and I didn't throw it out because I see no sense in buying something just to throw it out, so I saved it, and I'll be using it as long as it still holds together. And um, like I said last year, she was only six weeks old, so she didn't really play with it or anything, and I had it tucked away, so it's still in really good condition. Um, First thing I'd like to point out is I got her this nice little cover here off of Etsy and it's made for a round basket but we didn't have a round basket so this just had to do uh, but yeah so it's embroidered with her name Graciela and it's got these cute little ties on the side so you can cinch it uh, closed tighter if you want to or you can loosen it up and it's pretty large, so it would fit on a bigger basket even. And um, yeah, I just, I think it's so, so adorable. So I got this on Etsy, and I'm going to link the shop that I got it from below because I think she did a, a wonderful job on it. And now for the goodies inside, I got these little toys at Target. Sorry, my, the chair keeps moving. <laughs> um, I accidentally pressed up against it. I got these little nesting dolls at Target. This one is a little fox and a rabbit. And it gets smaller to a little raccoon and a baby chicken. So those are just nesting dolls. You can put them inside each other, but I decided to put some all natural uh, chocolates inside of those instead of Easter eggs. I just, oh, these are just so, so cute. And they are wood, so they're nice quality. Um, it'll be hard for her to break these. <laughs> and um, I just, I really love wooden toys rather than plastic. I did get some plastic toys, but I, I really love that these are wood and they look uh, painted. So these are just so adorable. It's got a little tail in the back. Those were $12 from Target, so it was a little bit of a splurge for her Easter basket because usually I just buy cheap stuff, but uh, they're toys that will last, and um, I'm going to put them away after the Easter season so I can bring them out every year. The next we got this little wooden noisemaker. It just goes like that. And this was from the dollar aisle at Target. You want to play with it for a minute? Then I got her this uh, little egg that is personalized as well. It's Graciela. This was off of Etsy. Um, it's wood burned on there and it's, they use all natural coating to seal it. I think they said they use uh, beeswax to seal it. So it's okay if she chews on it, whatever plays with it. So I thought that was really, really cute, and I'll be putting that away after the Easter season as well so I can bring it out every year. And I do have one Easter egg in here with um, just two natural chocolates. Um, I believe these are Thomas and Sons brand. Just little Easter chocolates. I'll let her have one or two on Easter. She's, I don't think she's ever had chocolate before. No, 
She's never had chocolate before. We don't really buy uh, goodies or like junk food type things. So she doesn't really get any of that. Then I also got these at Target. It says, uh, let us be friends and open wide. And these are really good quality. They're pretty heavy, so they're not uh, flimsy, throw them around type of plates. And then they've got this rubber on the bottom so that it gets a good grip so it's not slipping around the table or her high chair tray. And I thought that if I got these cute little dividers, she would have more fun at mealtime and um, hopefully decide to eat more. More would make it into her mouth. We'll see how that goes. And then I also got these little snack containers that match these plates for when we're on the go. So it's got three, three tiered here and the tops just pull off and then you can separate these as well or put them back together. Maybe. There we go. Yeah. I just thought this was super cute. Good idea. You can see through it to see what's in each uh, container and nice for snacks on the go rather than baggies that you just throw away. Then I've got some stickers here for her because she loves playing with tape off packaging and stickers and so I thought that these would be a nice little addition to her Easter basket. These were two for a dollar at Walgreens and then this was 99 cents. So there's 80 stickers in there. 99 cents and they are they're pretty good stickers. They're, um, there's some sparkly Easter ones here and then some regular ones. And these little books are just the tiny circular ones that she can play with. Then I found this at Target as well and I think she's going to love it because every time we're at the store and you know they have those little pens that you can sign for your credit card well she's always she always loves to play with that while I'm uh, checking out so I'll just hold her and let her draw on the little screen there and it disappears right away but she loves that so this is pretty much the same idea and it's Minnie Mouse which she is obsessed with she loves Minnie and Mickey and this was only a dollar fifty at Walgreens. So that was a nice little find there. And then it's got the little thing to erase what you draw. So we'll bring this on uh, car rides or just around the house to play with. It's got the little pen. I wish the pen was on a string though, so it <laughs> isn't so easy to lose. But it was only a dollar fifty, so that was still a great find. Got this little ball here, uh, just a, a fun, funky little ball, and it flashes. Yeah. So I, I think she's gonna love that. And then, last but not least, I got her this pinwheel at Target. She loved playing with them while we were walking around the store. And it was only a dollar from the dollar section, so I had to get her one. I think we'll um, like playing outside with the wind with this. That is Graciela's Easter basket for this year. I hope uh, you liked this video. I had so much fun shopping and putting this together, and um, I think it came out really well. Tell me some things that you got for your little ones for Easter. Give me some ideas for next year. Um, let me know how old your kids are too so that I can get an idea of as she gets older. And thank you everybody for watching. I hope you have a wonderful weekend, a wonderful Easter. Spend it with family and just have a great time. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.